There was an increased police presence at a middle school in Fort Worth today following a deadly shooting nearby. One person was shot and killed yesterday and another was wounded in an apartment complex not far from the school. Letters were sent to families of Leonard Middle School students. Fox News Dion Anglin joins us now with more on what police are saying. Dion. Hi there, Steve. Well, uh, the Fort Worth ISD has told families of Leonard Middle School here that an ongoing police investigation has impacted the school community. No specifics were given. However, the timing is one day after a youngster was killed and another injured in a shooting not far from here. Police were uh, dispatched for a shooting call. Uh, once officers arrived, they found uh, two juveniles to be shot. Uh, they both were transported to the hospital. One was pronounced deceased at the hospital. That gunfire on Sunday afternoon happened here at the 2900 Broadmoor apartment complex. It left one juvenile boy dead and another injured. Investigators say the two youngsters were in a breezeway at the complex when witnesses say three other males approached them. Police say one or more of those individuals fired the shots, and they are trying to determine why. What exactly happened? I mean, you know, who these males are that actually did, who, who are the suspects? What, what were the, the ties between the victims, or if they were? We don't, we don't know that. And as a result, the motive also remains unknown. Meantime, police presence is heightened at Leonard Middle School in Fort Worth, which is not far from the shooting scene. The school district sent a communication to parents, alerting them of a connection between the school and the investigation. Fort Worth ISD is collaborating with the Fort Worth Police Department as they continue an ongoing investigation. In an abundance of caution, we will have extra police presence and security there. On Monday, a steady stream of parents were seen picking up students earlier than dismissal time. As for the police investigation, officers continue to pursue possible witnesses and scour the area for surveillance video. They are strongly urging the public's help. We're just asking the public if anyone was in the area, if they know any information that may be pertinent to helping us out, we, they welcome it. And they'll be glad to take those calls. Now, at this time, there is no update on the condition of the youngster who survived uh, the shooting. Again, uh, uh, up. Uh, uh, Police presence uh, was heightened here today at Leonard Middle School. And one parent who we talked to who de declined an on-camera interview told us that her student and others went to their first class today and they remained in those first classrooms uh, for the entire, if not the entire, the majority of the day. In other words, they did not leave the initial class that they went to this morning. It's the very latest live. Steve, back to you. All right, that's Dion Anglin in Fort Worth outside Leonard Middle School. Dion, thanks. Mm -hmm.